right, so now we're going to go back to our Epic Game Launcher, and I will click on the Unreal Engine tab. And under Marketplace, there's a tab with free. And there's just a ton of free stuff. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to look at permanently free coll uh, collection. And we're looking for trees that would fit. Now, I know there's a bunch of them, and so I might use a different one. I'm going to use these cactus. But you know what your world is about. And you'll see there's like several other, uh, you know, tabs that you can keep going. And I rather, you know, there is a search bar, but I find it doesn't always work as well as, a, as it should. So I just find it's just easier to, to click on free, permanently free for my students and look through there and find a vegetation. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to purchase this. So you, I've already purchased it. So you're going to have to click purchase and then just check out. It won't charge you anything because uh, you're in the free section. So you don't have to worry about that. Once you have it, so remember, like in your case, you'll have very little. So this, the one I picked was called Mediterranean Vegetation. So you will click on your library tab and you will scroll. As you can see, I have several projects. I've been doing this for a little while, playing around. Uh, and now here, let's type vegetation because I have so many. And I think the one that I was looking, you know, there's some really nice trees here, was Mediterranean vegetation. So you see how there's this add to project? So what you're going to do is you're going to click, and this is the project I want to add it to. So I'm going to click add, and it'll take a few minutes, and it will add it. Now, a lot like the mega scans, it will create a folder call vegetation or something similar so just keep in mind the name and what I'm going to do here in a second is I'm going to open the Unreal Engine and go make sure it's there so as you can see it actually I reopened my project and here's the folder and under meshes I can just click and and drag uh, some of these things just to double check them and again I'm just want to have a quick peek and see what they look like um, so yeah it's I think it's frozen but you know Basically, there you go, and I'll drop one and press F, and I get a sense. It it takes a few seconds for it to uh, to uh, process and compile the shaders, and I'll talk about this in the next video. For now, what you want to do is maybe have a quick look. If you if it's not the one you want, what you can always do, and it's super easy to do this. Let's say you're like this takes up room on my computer. I don't like it. I'm gonna delete it, and I can go get a different one. Okay, and then just go back to the marketplace and add it. All right, so there you go. Thank you.